And the podcast will begin in 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Ladies and gentlemen, a good friend of mine, finally here on the podcast, Miss Malu Toller. How are you, Malu? Hola! Thanks for having me, guys. Thanks, Paco, Paco, for having me. This is an awesome place. Oy, thank you. Like it. For an awesome person. Kamusta ka na? No beauty parade. Alam mo, alam mo meron, kami, meron kami pinag-uusapan dito, eh, no? So, before tayo mag, ano, mag-start, sabi mm-hmm. ko, you have to be, what, three inches yeah. away from the mic. Mm-hmm. Di ba? Yeah. Pag lalaki ang kausap ko, ang ginagawa nila ganito. Nilalapit nila yung mic sa kanila. Bakit? <laughs> Pag babae ang kausap ko, uh-huh. well, actually, hindi. Ikaw pa lang ang babae nakita kong gumaging ganito. Nilalapit mo yung sarili mo sa mic. Mm. Uh-huh. Ano yon? Y- yung sarili namin, nilalapit namin sa mic? Hindi, ikaw. Ako? Nilalapit mo yung sarili mo sa mic. Oh. Normally, sinabi ko, ilapit mo yung, ilapit mo yung mic sa sa'yo. Pero for some reason. Ako lumalapit. Oh, ah. uh, Sanay ako dun. Oh, you- <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm confused. <laughs> I told you we, we were in the car wash. <laughs> I was lying. <laughs> anyway, guys, Malu Toller. Okay, so Malu is a Malu is not only Malu is a, an independent artist. She's. A, I'm very proud of you and what you've done because talagang talagang you are not waiting for anybody to pick you up. You know how to pick yourself up. Yeah. You're also a real tour. Mm-hmm. And you're also a hustler. Sabi marunong ka kumita ng pera. <laughs> All around. And you're a mom and you're a wife. And a grandma. And a grandma already. Yeah, Congratulations, yeah. my God. <laughs> so simulan natin sa mga project mo. I, I've seen, you know, bago nagkaroon ng pandemic, you were doing shows here and there. You even mm-hmm. won an award last year. Yeah. Um, Awards. Th- Oh, si uh, banggitin mo na lahat ng awards mo, dai. Four awards in one year, like. Papa, ano kana na ng awards? Um, I think they select from all the uh, Filipino American artists. And Sino kalaban mo don? Oh, <laughs> pwede mo naman banggit. <laughs> anyway, I, anyway, it's ibibit. not only in the Filipino market because, di ba uh-huh. na, I I also got it in Hollywood. Uh, so it's it's really like uh, a dream come true, you know, most especially when I won the Malibu Music Award. That's one of right. the the best. But uh-huh. all of them I really appreciate them. Ang tanong ko, ang tanong ko, how long have you been doing this? I was fourteen years old when I started singing. That was seven years ago. Oh, I ko naman six years ago. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so you've been doing this since 14. Ang, mm. ang maganda rito, you've always threaded forward eh. Di ba? Yeah. Minsan, minsan may mga rejections, pero wala, wala kang pakiram sa ganyan. You dust yourself off and then keep moving forward eh. Yeah. yeah. Saan mo nakukuha yung strength na yun? From him. Amen. I'm, I know, me and him are very close. Okay. Well, <laughs> and, and the reason why I ask is mm-hmm. because there are our young audience that then are listening mm-hmm. and most of them maybe some of them might be in a position na kung saan ka nandun before mm-hmm. na marireject sa ganito may mga tao magsasabing huwag mo nang gawin yan hindi, ka mag, hindi mo kaya yan or mga ganon ano ang naging motivation mo nung 14 ka so sinabi mo sa sarili mo kakanta ako and then what? No, the first time I saw someone playing in uh, in bodega Two years saw, ago to two years ago. ago. <laughs> I was only 13 or 12 years old and I said, that's what I want to do. Paano ka nakapunta sa bodega ng 13 years old? Ka Pwede, nightclub yun ni. Eh. Pwede, hindi bodega sa Quezon Boulevard. Oh, ka nightclub yun. No, they don't ask sa for Tomas age. Sa Tomas Morato yun, di ba? No, no, no. That's an that's, uh, international pub. I oh, was okay. singing in international at pub. 14? Eh. At 14? At 14. My God, hindi ka ba nag high school? Nag high school. Sa St. Joseph ako eh. Okay, sa I Rodriguez. Was, I was still in high school when I was performing. St. Joseph sa Rodriguez. Taga, mm-hmm. taga Quezon City ka ba? Yes, taga Project 4 ako eh. Project 4. Anong street? Uh, Camerino. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Malapit sa, okay. Anyway, so 14, St. Joe, tapos kumakanta ka sa bodega. Mm-hmm. 
Ano sabi ng magulang mo nito? They can't stop me. I tell them, you so, know. So unstoppable ka na bata Unstoppable ako. Oh And I'm the youngest, so they cannot, you know, they can't do anything. They're, I'm the seventh, dude. So Seven kayo mag they're, they're tired. <laughs> when, it come, when it came to me, like, just let it go. <laughs> okay. So, Malu, 14 years old, mm-hmm. singer, na unang-una sinabi mo nung nagpunta ka sa bodega, may nakita kang kumakata. Ano ang ginagawa mo sa bodega ng edad na 13 anos, 14 anos? Kasama ko, kuya ko. Kasi <laughs> so, alam na nila magal- mahuhilig na akong tumugtog. Hindi, sinabi mo magaling kang... Nadulas ka eh. Sinabi mo magaling ka. Magaling na akong mag-gitara nung 9 years old okay. ako eh. So, so 9, years old, kuma- 9 years old, tumutugtog ka na talaga. Nag-gitara na ako sa, ano, sa simbahan. Anong gatas ba ang ininom mo? Hindi sa nanay ko, naubos okay. eh. <laughs> Inubos sa nung anim. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Now, okay. Now, Malu. Um, nine years old, you've had this passion for music. Mm-hmm. At 13, you knew what you wanted to do. Mm-hmm. Did you pursue ha- school hanggang college o hindi na? Hindi na. Because my mom always tell me like, you just finish your college and then you move on with your, your singing. I said, why do I have to do that? Sabi niya, eh paano kung hindi ka maging successful? Sabi ko, bakit mo naman sinabi hindi ako maging successful? I know. Anong feeling pag sinabihan ka ng gano'n ng nanay mo? I get, I get more, ano, challenged. Motivated, di ba? I'm so challenged. So, I went home like, uh, I, think, I think 3 o'clock, 4 o'clock in the morning and then I, I told my mom, Mom, you need to drive me to the airport. Oh. And she said, oh, Ilan taong ka nito? 16. Okay, 16. Okay, so dalawang taong ka ng professional nito. Okay. She said, uh, why? I said, if you don't, I'm going to get sued because I'm going to Japan t- at 7 o'clock. And I said, Mom, I'm going to go to jail. I signed for you. <laughs> <laughs> That's how I was. That, I'm, I'm very, very stubborn. Even they say no to me, the more I want to push. Now, don't you find other... Okay. When you say the more they say no, the more you push, hindi mo naisip na minsan but they might mean well? Well, as far as I'm concerned, I know what I want. And I pray to God to guide me. If it will work, just carry me on. Thank you, you for know? saying that, yeah. That's, that's really, I just have faith in Him. Mm. Everything that's happening to my life, I didn't plan it. Right. He did. Kumbaga, may goal ka lang, and then bahala na si Lord kung sa kandalin. Yes, I always have a goal, and I always pray to Him, you know, lead me to the right path. Just, right. Like for other musicians who wants to be successful, they don't even know how you want to be a singer. You want to be a recording or a performer. They don't have a goal. Right. So if you don't know where you're going, how do you know which road to take? Now, another thing, you know what you sinabi mong yun eh? Because I guess part of who you are and what makes you unique is you, you, ano eh, you shine the room. Oh, <laughs> kita mo. <laughs> <laughs> no, pero totoo eh. Like, like pagod ka kanina. Ang dami mo, like, galing ang work. Mm-hmm. Galing kang work before coming to Paco's Place. Thank you so much for being here. Oh. Di ba? Pero, sa ating apat, apat tayo rito si Michael Abad at saka si JJ Buen kami na shout out sa kanila behind the camera. Pagdating mo rito, ano ba? Ang tahi-tahimik niyong lahat. <laughs> and, uh, you know, like, I'm like, ready to rock and roll. <laughs> right? And this is not this is not a facade. This is you. This is me. What you see is what you get. Right. You know? And you do this sa mga sa mga Facebook live uh, mm-hmm. live streams mo. Yeah, yeah. Ang hindi ko maintindihan, bakit ang dami bumabati ko sa iyo? Anong problema nila? O anong problema mo? <laughs> Most of the time is because I'm I'm wo- I'm really who I am. You know, I cannot be who they want me to be. This is very important for me. You please know? share. Huh? Please, ex- you, please, time you, out, time out. It, please elaborate because ang daming tao na nahihiya na ipagmalaki yung pagkataon la for fear of being cancelled. But, yeah. but you are not afraid not. of being cancelled, di ba? No, I'm never afraid of Can being cancelled. Can you please, canceled. okay, now let's expound again. Let's go back. Bakit, bakit ka binabatikos ng mga tao and paano mo nakokontra lahat yun? Long, ano, a long explanation. Okay, huh? the, the, we have first all night. Thing, the first thing that these pe- people are doing is that they want to join me for, you know, all the fun that I have. I get to 
uh, venues, uh, VIP. Oh, pass, yung mga House of Blues mo. Yeah, they, 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 they do get along with me. And then when I tell them certain things, please don't do that. Like what? And they get, you know, like, I'm pl- performing in House of Blues and they will be standing in the middle of the stage and taking videos of me and screaming when there are people behind you who are not Asians. <laughs> okay. And they don't even want some people, they don't want you to take a video of them because they might be then go to work and then you will put it live on Facebook. They get in trouble. So if I tell them to do something that I don't want my band to get affected by the management, right. they become very defensive. And... And that one will start, they, they will start, oh, she's so bossy, or I'm not bossy, I do everything on my own. Ayaw mo lang mapahamak yung audience mo at saka ikaw. It's my, Kasi it's, may rules. May rules yes, eh, there's a rule, in, especially Hollywood, right? Yes. Especially um, House of Blues. Discretion yan eh. Anong yes. room yun? Anong, uh, uh, foundation, foundation room. room. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it's very, very hard to get into yes, that Yes, I agree. You know? I, I would really want to help Uh, Filipino bands to get in. I really do. That's why I'm staying there. And I try to bring in more Filipinos. Dude, it's a headache. When they said, you have to be there at 7 if you're performing at 8. <laughs> Filipino time. 7.45, they say, I'm there. I said, where were you? In the parking lot. I said, oh my God. <laughs> they, I tried. You know, but discipline is very, very important. If you have a show at 8 o'clock, you need to prepare yourself and relax and be there early, you know. As what the management is saying, it's not only for the band, it's for everybody, it's for everybody you know. And, and you, you didn't do this only once. You've done this so many times in the foundation room. Yeah. Actually, regular ka na nga ni. Eh. Every month. Diba? Yeah, I perform every month. And, and for you to be able to go back and go back, management really loves your work ethic. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to save. And some of these people also are, those people who are like trying to ruin me, they, they are they are under mental disability. <laughs> Opa, explain, explain. <laughs> explain. <laughs> Oh, hindi ako, hindi ako yung nag-snort, ha? Siya yun. Ex- explain. True. Ex- true. Explain. It's really, true. Really. Huwag mo without mentioning names. Okay. I even went to the court mm. and restrained someone. Lalaki to babae? Both. Oh, wow. Okay. So, when, 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 when the judge said, okay, three years, you don't stay away from her. You know what he said? What? I object, Your Honor. <laughs> Are they normal? <laughs> Are they normal? You know? So, pero, I... Have... Pero you have time for all. Alam mo, yun na nakakaano sa'yo eh, no? You, 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 people throw you lemons and you turn it into lemonade. Alam mo yun? Yeah, tipong, yeah. Tipong hindi mo, hindi ka nagpapa-phase sa kanila eh. Oh, especially now, I've changed a lot because oh, really? I've ch- I changed a lot, yeah. <laughs> Nag-mellow I, ka na dyan. I, I, I mean, I normally like, you know, if you bash me, I bash you back, uh-huh. man. I'm a rock star. Of course, ngayon, peace, ka, ngayon, peace man. No, 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 peace man. May, pinag, may, may, uh, may pinagagamot akong bata, ano. May hinihingin ako sa Diyos, nagpapakabait na po. <laughs> Amen naman. Hindi ko napapatulan yung mga baliw. <laughs> Pero nag enjoy ka. Ako nag enjoy ako pag pinapanood ko, pinapatulan mo yung mga tao. Parang, ano mo yun, Mike? Parang, sabi nga, sabi nga namin ni Michael Labad, sino pa bang kailangan natin i-guess? And then ako, si JJ, si Michael Labad, nag-ano ko, nag-live-stream ko nun. Sabi namin tatlo, si Malu. <laughs> At saka, di ba sabi ko, no limitation, you know, just uh-huh. just ask whatever you ask. But because, you know, Lang, yeah. you Ikaw have naman, to have an intrigue. Sandali, puro ka naman si no limitation, just ask, just ask, kung sumagot ka naman. <laughs> Hindi ka naman sumasagot. <laughs> Kasi I don't, I don't want them to be in okay, my okay, life, okay, okay. you okay, know, like. Okay. You don't want to, you don't want to give them, uh, The limelight. Okay. I don't want, I don't, I, don't, I will never, they will never rain on my parade. Uh, that's my original song. That's why, I, that's why I wrote that song, Never Rain on My Parade. Ano lyrics niya? 
I gave you my heart, you wanted my soul. You said I lost my self-control. Ooh. Uh. Now, grandma, sinay mo grandma ka. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm a rockin' grandma. Kailan, do- kailan nangyari ito? Akala, akala, bago lang tum- tumanda yung anak mong babae eh. Oh, bunso yun. 21 dollars. Ay, oh. 21 years. <laughs> Ay, sorry. <laughs> Kinatok pa. <laughs> si, si Malu talaga basta pera eh, no? Basta pera, lumalabas sa bibig eh. Pera tsaka interest rate. <laughs> oh my God. Nagmo-mortgage ka rin ba? Or yeah, mortgage? I'm, so, okay. I'm so good at that, dude. Tell them, I will help you guys. If you help me, I'll help you. Because if you go through me, you will have Rockstar Foundation. You help sick children all over the world. Yun na. Yung ba yung pangalan ng foundation? May foundation uh-huh. ka Rockstar's Rock Star. Foundation. With an S. Yes. So, I put the Rockstar's Foundation. So, anybody who would support this, you know, if I approach, you know, Rockstar's, and they will, hey, I like your name, you know. So I already talked to the musical director, Michael Jackson, about it. And he said, mm. how come only you thought about that? Galing. So I said, he told me. May, may, may website na ba yan? Or? No, I'm in the process of uh, um, doing the, how they call that, 501c3? 501c3, yeah. yeah yung non-profit. Yeah, mm. I'm on that. When I get that, the next step is a website. Yeah, let me know. Para at least, pagbalik mo rito, we'll talk about that naman talaga. Yeah, diba? that's the most important thing for me right now. Like, a lot of sick children, especially all over the world. I say all over the world because some of our friends lives in Australia and they need help too, you know? So, I was able to help some friends there even during the pandemic. Mm-hmm. I was doing live show just to collect for uh, single moms and unemployed musicians. I did that. God bless you. Buti naman ginagawa mo yan. Now, your husband is very supportive. You and your husband are bandmates also. Yeah, he's my, um, he's uh, my, really my sound engineer. O oh, ngayon, dinemote mo naman. Ikaw talaga. No, really, he's not my band member. He just looks like a rock and roll. <laughs> okay, okay. Sa kayo nagkakilala ng ano, ng, ng asawa mo? He was hired as my, sound, our sound engineer wow, by my manager. Wow, lang iya. Ikaw talaga, bantay sa laki ka eh. Eh, no? he, he looks like eh. he's legal eh. <laughs> Hello, I, I said, hi, hi, I said, um, hi, I'm Carl, I'm not legal. <laughs> sa kayo nagkakilala, Malu? Sa gig ko sa Holiday Inn, sa Torrance. Okay, when was this? Some time ago. 1998. Okay. 1997. 1997. And bagay kayong dalawa, dahil pag nakikita ko, yung dal- pag nakikita ko kayong magkasama, siya yung tahimik ko yung madaldal. O, oh, di ba? Palagi bang ganun, kahit sa bahay? Ay, hindi. <laughs> Ako yung tayimik, kaya nga sabi ko, and they think you're quiet. <laughs> Guys, mean, pag nakita niyo yung asawa ni Malu, nakaganon lang yun. Gaganon uh, lang yun. Mag-ahay lang yun, then tayimik na. Kamukha ni Clinton. <laughs> oh, at saka yung si, ikaw si Hillary. Hindi, Maluwinski. <laughs> Do you have a cigar? <laughs> Isn't it? Maluwinski. <laughs> Alam mo, Huwag ka ganyan, hindi, hindi ko na matanggal sa utak ko yung, <laughs> yung cigar. Okay, Japan. Balik tayo sa Japan. Mm-hmm. Ma'am, hatid mo ako sa airport, kundi makukulong isa sa atin. Dali mo ako sa Japan. And then what? And then I went with Amelia Apolinario Group. I, it's like a Filipino tropical island show. It's really a huge show. Really so, huge. So, nagtinikling ka ron. No, no, I was wearing a grass skirt. <laughs> <laughs> oh, nakabra ako ano. Ka- coconut. <laughs> really? Tuk, tuk. It's so hard to make <laughs> money, dude. Anong, anong, anong gano'n? Tan-tan-tan-tan-tan-tan-tan-tan. Pumipitik pa yun. Tik-tik-tik-tik-tik. Pero during that time, Japanese don't know how to speak English, my God. Okay. So I'm very fluent speaking Japanese too, and I write. Hajime yamashite. Yoroshiko, negashimashite. Oh, uh, hi. <laughs> <laughs> Ilang alam ko. How do you, how, how nice to meet you. Hi. Dozo. Hi, dozo. <laughs> Dati meron pa ako ha. And then makakete ko dasay. Uh, the, Call me. Uh, <laughs> Agad din lang ako. Wala na. Kinalimutan ko na yung mga iba, yung mga ibang pick-up lines. But I, they're so cute, right? Oh, yeah. They're, they're Japanese. They're, they're, so, they're so cute. 
Ngayon right. yung, yung five-year-old kong anak, si Cassidy. Oh, she's nai, so cute. Nai, thank you. Nahihilig sa anime. So pag nagkakrack ako ng joke, kung tumawa yung anak ko, parang anime. <laughs> You know, someone told me that, Malu, you should be an anime. Hindi pwede yung tawa mo, hindi pang anime. Sabi ko, a special hero. Oh, di ba, may power yung baril ko. Oh my God. So, 90, okay, hindi, hindi. Kunyari na lang 90s. So, nasa Japan ka na nito, teenager ka. Tapos? Tapos ano, bumalik ako. Bakit ka bumalik? Tapos yung kontrata. The contract. You know, you have to go back and forth. And then... Um, But your mom and dad were old not this time, no? My dad is... Patay my, na. My dad was gone. So, okay. uh, after I came back, um, I played at the Father's Mustache and Hobbit House. Mm. Right? So, I became one of the uh, house band of Father's Mustache. And then, they saw us performing there and they sent me to Qatar. <laughs> wow. Yeah, I replaced Lirio Vita and there was th- three uh, band members. And during that time, it was, you know, in 1980s, you know, like early right. 80s. Yeah. I was being paid $150 a day in the Sheraton Hotel, you know. So after that, we came back. Wala, we, tega, plus tip pa yun. Uh, Wala. We're not allowed to oh, sit with man. them. It's a... Five-star hotel. That's why I like Teka, it. Teka, ba, ba, bakit? Kailangan ba naka-table ka para bigyan ka ng tip? Oh, hindi, ba yeah. pwede, hindi ka ba pwede bigyan ng tip habang kumakanta? Bawal sa Qatar, Muslim country. Ah. Tsaka yung damit, lahat ng damit ko pinalitan. Hindi ako makahinga. <laughs> so naka-mask ka rin ng mga panahon na yun? <laughs> hindi, pero nag-TV ako doon. Oh yeah, bakit? Ang sama ng tubig. <laughs> oh talaga? Bu- bu- uh, buong one month ang, praj- ang kontra ko, puro ininom ko soda hindi ako mga number two. <laughs> oh, constipated ka. Yeah, but it was a good experience, but I don't really want to go back. Which one? The constipation? Or pata? <laughs> Both. Oh. <laughs> I was not even allowed to go out because of the danger during that time. Right. You know, so then after I went back to Manila, Vic Miranda saw me again in, mm. in uh, uh, Father's Mustache. And then I played at the Intercon Hotel. Tapos? The, La Boulevard Day. Yeah, Boulevard Day. Ah. Every Sunday, I, I was performing there. And then... Um, uh, Sayang wala ng Intercon, alam mo ba yun? Ginibahan yeah, nila. No. Yeah. Dati pinupuntahan ko La Boulevard Day, tapos Jeep, di, Jeep ni Grill. Yes, yes, diba? yes. I like that. Boulevard Day, I like that. Music and Magic, I was, I was with them too. I was the alternate, or I'm, I, I'm supposed to be the opening act for them. Mm. But after that, uh, I finished my contract. I went to M- Hotel Mirador, Mirador Hotel. Yeah. I went there and then Dave Lock met me, a Singaporean, brought me to Singapore. So, okay, so Japan, Qatar, Singapore. Okay, how long were you in Singapore? 12 years. Doon ka na nagdalaga. Yeah. Doon ka na lumande, in other words. Hindi, malandi na talaga. Okay. Okay. Kailan pumasok ang love life dyan? May love life ka ba sa, sa Japan? Sa, Meron. Mm. Yung, yung, And the reason why I ask is because magtatanong, magtataka yung mga ibang tao na gusto mag-abroad. Okay. May iniwana ka bang boyfriend nung nag-Japan ka? Yeah. Yeah. Break kayo or long distance kunyari? Long distance lang. Nagtagal ba? Nag-work Nagtagal, ba? oh. Pero may yeah. binoyfriend ka rin sa Japan? Nagka, no. Nagkaanak ka ako dun sa... Ano, dun ka nag... Dun yung panganay. Yes. Okay, okay. Gitarista ko yun eh. Ikaw uh, talaga eh. Bantay sa laki ka ng banda Hindi ko na ulitin yun. Eh. Inulit mo. Yung sound engineer mo nga. Sound engineer <laughs> pero hindi gitarista. <laughs> ah! So pa iba-iba. <laughs> iba-iba character <laughs> niyan. <laughs> ilan sila? Ilan silang total? Dalawa lang. Okay, okay. Sila ang anak mo sa gitarista? Ah, uh, dalawa. Dalawa. Okay. We'll be back up. Uh, pag-uusapan natin love life ni Malu Toller after this reminder. And we're back. Grabe. Eight seconds na commercial. Ang hirap-hirap dahil sa eight seconds na yun, ang daming gustong ikwento ni Malu backstage. I can't keep quiet. <laughs> okay. Now, Pag-usapan natin ang love lies, love, love lies. Love lies. Love, love life mo. Kaya ako gusto pag-usapan yon is because may mga 
mag <clears throat> mag shot ah mm-hmm. na ayo pa alisin ni babae ay ni lalaki si babae at ayo or ayo pa alisin ni babae si lalaki yeah nangyari ba sa iyo yun hindi <laughs> sinama mo hindi um if it's if i can be controlled in the beginning pa lang 16 years old ako na control na niya ako hindi ako na control pero naanak ang kanya Oh, but that I really wanted. Ito, it. Ako kumontrol sa kanya. Ako uh, no, ako nagsabi anak kanya ako. <laughs> Sige na, pare, uwi mo na ako. <laughs> okay. So, you went to Japan, naghiwalay kayo. Hindi. Um, the pagbalik ko, nag uh, nagkaroon na ako ng baby. Mm. Yung pangalawang contract ko sa Japan, kasama ko na siya. Okay, iniwanan Aba. niya yung baby. Oh, and dun, that's life in in the Philippines, yes. right? So, um, six months. Ano pangalan ng panganay mo? Carlo. Carlo, shout out sa'yo, Carlo. So, si Carlo ang may baby? <laughs> Oo, siya yung may apat na anak. Apat na ang anak? Wow, congratulations to you. And then the second one is Pauline. Uh-huh. She has three kids. So, seven na? Seven. Oh my God. And it's so much fun when you're younger, you know. Yeah, they enjoy because, mo sila. Yeah, I, I play games with them outside, you oh know. Oh my goodness, si Carla yeah. si Pauline. Now, after Japan, when did you realize that I have to be smart about myself? Because no one will take care of me except myself. Kasi maraming, di ba maraming nalulokong mga OFW dahil may umaasa sila kung kanikanino. Yeah. Pero ikaw, tingin ko sa'yo, you were headstrong from the beginning eh. I was headstrong and I got the best uh, accommodation and lodging. Lodging ko sa Japan. May sugar daddy ka ron? No, I was, they were, they treated me like a kid. I was Because a you, kid. Were, you were I a kid. I was a kid, yeah. I was not allowed to talk to the, okay, to the guests. Uh-huh. And five, that's why five-star hotels in Japan is like that. You're not yeah. permitted Walang to table, sit table, down. Table, no, know. no. So, anong, anong reason kung bakit ka naging headstrong nga? Because I lost my dad very early. I was the youngest. How old were you? you? Yeah, how old were you when you lost he your was, dad? He was, I was 14. Wow. Oh, nung time, na, nung, nung time and, na gumagala-gala ka ng bodega? Mm-hmm. I was 14. But Hindi I was, kaya yun na ikinamatay niya dahil... I was already performing there. I was okay, already yeah. performing across the street from, uh, uh, what's that? Uh, St. Luke's Trinity College, right? Yes, uh, yes. I was, uh, the stallion, there was a stallion bar across the street. <laughs> I was just having lunch and then there was someone singing. My classmate was uh, Coco Laurel's sister. Uh, Iwi? No, uh, Stella. Stella. Iwi is my batchmate too. Okay. So, so Stella started saying, Hey, can my friends sing? You know, we thought it was jamming, you know. So I went up on stage, so I sang and sang. And then afterwards, here comes the owner asking me how much. Oh. I said, I ate here, you're asking me money. You love pala katapat eh, no? Yeah. Magkano bill ko kung makasobra? Kakanta na lang ako, Yeah, but that was the beginning that I don't even know how much yung mga budgetan. Right. You know, I just said 50. <laughs> I was 50. But the, the the folk singers was making like 40 pesos in Crown Delights. <laughs> okay. Pupatuloy kita rin ha? Because maganda yung sinabi mo eh. Bagito ka, wala kang experience, mm-hmm. nag-isip ka lang ng number. 50, yeah. right? But... No, why? You know why I say 50? Why? Para wala nang sukli. <laughs> Para oh, wala nang butas. So, right? oh, di ba? Now, kaya ako natanong yun is because, again, from the beginning nga, if you guys, our audience, are pay, we're paying attention, nabangit ko nga na you, Malu, are a do-it-yourself do it kind of person. Yeah. You, okay? You, you really make roads where there are no roads. Eh. Mm-hmm. And ngayon, pa, 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 at an early age, nalagyan mo ng value yung sarili mo. Eh. Yeah. yeah. Wala kang pakialam sa iba. Wala kang pakialam kung magkano ang tingin ng iba sa'yo. Alam mo kung magkano ang tingin mo sa sarili. I know how much I am. You Explain know? that to other people na, you know, lacking the confidence and the... You know, a lot of uh, musicians right now, they they don't really prepare themselves You know, like, especially in America, this is what I noticed. They go to work, they go to work, they they prepare like an hour and go on stage and start playing like warm-up only. No, you go there, you go give your best right away. Right away. You know? So I don't really work. I have a lot of work, but 
during my performance, performance day, I'm a little taller than Rockstar. I've already, starting in the morning, I turn on my, my amplifier, get my guitar, I started play. I start playing. Oh, kailan, kailan mo sinabi sa sarili mo na hindi ka lang singer, rockstar ka? Kailan mo sinabi sa sarili mo yun? I didn't. <laughs> I didn't. I just did what I want to do. I, yun nga, pero, you know, someone pero yung, called pero, me that. Right, but then again, you embodied that. Kung baga, yeah. someone called you, pwede mo naman i-deflect eh. Hindi mo din-deflect. Inangkin mo. It, there is this um, Kailan person, nangyari yun? Kailan nangyari yun? No, uh, Kasi tanda mo, prior to that, naka-grass skirt ka lang at naka no, 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 no. When I was already here, I used to be, when I arrived here, I joined this uh, ballroom band. So, ballroom, tapos tinawag ka rockstar? Yeah, the, the, that was the beginning first. No, not the rockstar. So, I didn't like playing ballroom music. I'm so sorry. Not Nothing personal. Not your cup of tea. Yeah, uh-huh. not, and I don't wear gowns. <laughs> I wear leather pants. And I'm very comfortable with that, you okay. know? So for the beginning, it's okay. That's the gig that I get. So after I had my my youngest, I was like, get, I get bored so fast. If there's nothing new song, there's nothing going on, I get bored, you know? So I said, I think I need to take a break, you know? Oh. So I took a break and I said, I'll, I want to start all over again. I want to be an acoustic singer first. So I started, Kasi ka naman eh. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So I started uh, singing acoustic and went to Musikan. Right. Kaya Tirso. Yeah, Kaya Tirso. Mm. And then Musikan, I met a lot of musicians. Like they have an open night, uh, open mic night. So I, whenever I'm on stage, here comes the guitarist will join me, you know. So I started jamming with them, different bands. And I, I went to different open mics. And until I went to Third Street Prominent, there was this Alula, is the 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 uh, one man band, mm. and I was there. I was drinking beer in my soda cup, you know. And, and he he went like, "Hey, is there anybody who knows how to play here?" You know, because so I look at play, his I said play guitar instrument, yeah, yeah. you know. So I I saw his bass. I I was a bass guitarist in Singapore, so I said, "Yeah, I'll play," you know. So I right. started playing the bass, you know. The next thing I know, my first gig was in Vegas. Kasama nito? Uh-huh. <laughs> Sumama ka naman? Yeah, why not? So, teka. Um, okay. Paano ka ba nagpunta ng Amerika? I was under the... Oh, from from Asia, I was under the... Under contract with Hyatt International. So, every every country that has Hyatt. So, pinadala ka dito? Yeah, from Indonesia... As a performer or as a marketing acoustic singer. acoustic singer? I was the lounge singer. So I was sent to Hawaii and then I finished 14 months there. And then I said, can I visit my mom? Because okay. my mom was here in, okay. in LA. So I said, I have five years. I said, almost five years. I said, I follow all your rules. And now my mom is just here and I can't yes. even see her. She said, okay. Just leave your stuff, bring it. I said, yeah, okay, but I'll bring my guitar, you know. And I wasn't planning. I wasn't planning until my mom said, hey, uh, your kids are getting big. I'm getting old, you know. Why don't you just stay here? So, nandito sa LA yung mga bata? No, my mom. My mom. But your so, kids were My kids was adopted by, by my husband. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so, there, I decided not to go back no more. You know, I left all my stuff there and Jumab ship. It's a Jumab hotel. I never even worry about hey, what's gonna happen to me. It's right. like I know that I'm go- I was gonna again, be okay. Again, again, gumagawa ka na naman sa yeah, daan, I was gonna be ba? okay. And then I worked for Arnold Schwarzenegger in Santa Monica, man. Wow. I opened the back door for him. <laughs> Okay, paano natin po i-interpretin yung sinasabi ni Maluna? She opened the back, back door. door for him. No, there's a door in the back of the restaurant. Okay. He has to go through that back door. Okay. <laughs> so before I open it for him, I'll tell him, can you sign an autograph? <laughs> Iniisip ko, bahay ba niya yung binubuksan? Oh, ano, ano. It's a restaurant. Restaurant. Okay. So you did, you really did a lot of things. Now, itong mga bagay-bagay na ginagawa mo, hindi to ala chamba eh, di ba? You do these things to get to the next step. Yeah. Ibig sabihin, planado. 
Isn't that important? Please explain. <laughs> is you have already, you know, um, a goal. So like, like when I did the foundation, you know, I've been thinking about that for more than five years. Right. And I've been praying to God to, to, to uh, guide me how to make that happen. Right. And it just happened. <laughs> And it just happened. I was just working on my laptop and then there comes this thing popped up and said, do you want to open a foundation? And I, I click on it and I said, how much is the expense? And, you know, that was the time when we received the stimulus and I said, oh, I can do that. So I use that. Galing. I'm helping anyway, so why not? Galing. Right? Tapos, saan pumasok yung, you know, papasok ako sa real estate. Kaya lang dumating sa buhay mo yun. Um... When I got sick being an, a junior accountant, like you oh, have to go to Like work. accountant ka ba? Yeah, I was trained. Uh, okay, while I was in Hawaii, I got bored because most of the people that you meet <laughs> are newlyweds, right? Oh, yeah. Or family on vacation. Yes. You know, so I talked to my general manager. I said, you know, I'm, I'm, almo- I'm almost 30. I don't know how to turn on a computer. So she, he let me. He let me Ang galing get naman, trained man. in the Talagang, office. Alam mo yun, alam mo yung napipick up ko sa'yo is yung, yung oras na oras and opportunity na pwede mong isingit ang pag-acquire ng bagong skill. Yeah, I gagawin grab it. Gagawin mo talaga. I grab Oo. it, yeah. Okay. So, so, when I was here and then <laughs> every time they interview me for a job, I always say, I know how to do that. I don't have to do that. Totoo ba yun? Oh. No. <laughs> but listen, listen. But when um when I, I I got I got hired and they told me about this thing and I said, you know what? You have a different system. <laughs> <laughs> you need to send me for a training. Dining way on. Ma utak na robot. And then they sent me for training and what I wanted to do is like I want to be the person who knows everything in there so I will be very important to the manager or to, to the business. It's not, I'm not going to work on what they ask me to do. I help this one, I help that one. So I'm, I'm learning the whole right. uh, uh, load of work oh. in, the, in the office. Tirador. Yeah, but I got sick of waking up early because I'm a rock star. <laughs> Oh, kasi tumutugtog rin sa gabi. Yeah. So, uh, I started learning. Um, I went to real estate. Cause, but, you know, before I went to real estate, I've al- I was already selling. So, I was hands-on already. So, I just took my exam. Para official. Yeah. Yeah. So, Para it's that was 17 years ago. So, 17 years ka ng realtor. Yeah. Kahit bumagsak ang market, God took care of me. Right. Never, never struggle. <laughs> Naalala ko, unang kilala ko kay Malu. Nasa Noy Pits tayo nun. Bigla, kumakain lang ako na maayos. Bigla ako sinitsitan. Psst. <laughs> Sabi ko, ano kong gusto sa akin itong babaeng ito? Psst. Psst. <laughs> Halika. Lap, la, oh, lapit naman ako. Kung bibili kang bahay ha, binigay sa akin yung card niya. Ako katawagan mo. Hindi ko makalimutan yun. Sabi ko, okay to. <laughs> but you know what? Most of these people, like, especially musicians, I gave them the, their dream. I'm very proud to say that. So bakit, kayo, bakit may mga naiinis at naiinggit sa'yo? Anong problema? Ang ganda ako eh. Okay, maliban doon. Alam na natin yun. Pero maliban. <laughs> I, I, I really don't know, man. I really don't. Oh, eh. I, it's... This, some, mo sila eh, some people na are saying. Eh. Some people are saying this. Like, you know what? This is what other people are saying. You know the problem with you, Malu, is you love to pick up trash. <laughs> the problem you know, may with you. pick up mga basura. May defecto, eh. Pick up mo pa rin. Ma- maawain ako, eh. And yeah. malay mo naman, di ba? May kasabihan na one man's trash is another person's treasure. Yeah, right? yeah. That, and, and if this person, if they say, oh, may, may differentiation, eh, wala namang ginawa sa akin. That's my Correct. problem, you know? So, kailangan ba dahil kaaway ng kaibigan mo? Dapat kaaway yeah, ka. Yeah, I don't Ganun do that, right? People are doing that right now. Hey, don't talk to Malu. If you invite Malu, I'm not going to your party. Go ahead. 
<laughs> may gano'n, ha? Yeah, I will tell them. I will even tell my friend, like, if she goes, I will go. How the, oh, so, nangiinis right? ka nga talaga. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I will talk to them, like, hey, guys, if you, I am your friend, we are all human, we make mistakes. If I make a mistake, you let me know. You talk to me, you don't talk about me. Amen. That's what I've been trying to tell my kids. You know, someday, harapan tayo, di ba? Magharapan tayo. Magharapan tayo. Kasi there are times na nag-inuman, hindi mo mawawala yun. Right. Right? Pero, some people, just because they're in our high, uh, nasa limelight na sila, they want the attention to them, not to me. I'm the performer here. <laughs> I'm not trying to show up something. I need to be myself. You know? So how do you deal with um I, I mean okay leading the comment uh your question but how do you deal with comments na masasakit because ang ang na, uh, natutuwa ako sa iyo minsan may magsasabi sa iyo ng masakit pero hindi mo binubura hinahayaan mo lang yun sa ano mo oh iya ko yun how does your husband deal with this how does si na Carlos si na Pauline deal with this how do you deal with this Because, I tell, I tell because my kids. tao ka rin eh. Yun ang yeah. point ko eh. Minsan ako'y nasasapa, oo, ang sakit ng sinabi nun na, pero, hindi titignan ko ulit, makikiboso lang ako. Aba, hindi binubura ni Malu. Hindi ko binubura yun. It's not gonna reflect on me. It's gonna reflect on them. What kind of person they are, you know? So, sometimes, my husband will get pissed with these people. You yeah. Know, like, you know, like he's, he's so scared of welcoming, uh, Filipinos in my house, you know, so... By the way, your husband's not Filipino, no? No. No, he is a white dude. <laughs> white dude. <laughs> okay. He's, yeah, so I'm, I feel embarrassed with my husband because I don't want him to think that Filipinos are like that, you know. So I have to show him that these people are receiving mental disability. <laughs> yeah. I have the proof of that. I can check people. <laughs> Oh, dahil bila background check nga pala. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Kunyari, yeah. bebenta ka kita ng ano, kaya kailangan lang kita yung background check. <laughs> oh, mental pala to. Aha, uh-huh. where's your income coming from? <laughs> But, that's not fair, man. Because, I pay a lot of money on taxes. <laughs> And there, the money goes to them, right? Yeah. So, that one I don't agree much. But, ang pinag-usapan natin is may, so the people who are gaming the system. Yeah, diba? they're gaming the system. And until now, you know, until now, they're still doing it. And those people that kaya, are... Hindi kaya kaya sila naiinis sa'yo is because you're calling them out for gaming the system? No, I haven't called them. Oh, you haven't called them out. <laughs> That's <laughs> a good idea. <laughs> oh. That is a good idea. But I forgive them, you know, because I know there's something wrong with them. Now I, I, I like, I usually like, Um, hey, by the way, you called me like this. Maybe who's better, you or me? I, 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 I used to do that, but I don't do that no more. I write it in my song. Nagmature ka na ina. <laughs> no, I think, I think. Um, Nagmelo ka na. I think I, I focus more on my foundation, you know, like. Which is good. Yeah, I focus more on what I really want to do for my next part of my life. Because I think my calling is to help out uh, sick children. I asked him that and a kid came back came and approached me. So ito mga detractors mo pag lumapit siya at biglang nag-apologize sa iyo, papatawarin mo. Always, I always forgive them. But stay away from me. <laughs> kung baga, kung baga, I love you from a distance, ganun. Ganun na lang. Yeah, move on. <laughs> Now, bakit sa tingin mo itong itong uh, local music natin dito sa sa sa, sa, sa LA? LA. Bakit basag-basag? Dahil ba sa logistics? Dahil malayo tayo sa isa't isa? O dahil may mga faction talaga at may... May problema. Oh, ano sa tingin mo I think it's all about jealousy. You know, like everybody wants to be <coughs> wants to be somebody. They, they don't wala want... Naman, wala naman masama ron, di ba? Yeah, walang masama ron, But don't ruin the person that you want to be someone. Ah. That's what I meant, you know? Correct. Like since when that a lot of a lot of them wants to be the rock star. Pwede naman maraming rock stars, di ba? Diba? But it didn't happen before. You, you remember? Nobody was 
receiving a rock star award. Nobody. So I think I, I started a trend there, you know. So na na brandan ko yung sarili ko. Mm-hmm. That's what I that's what I think I did without knowing it, you know. Kapag gumawa ka na sa ilim ng branding, Oh, ganun. yeah. So when they say the rock star, they already know it's Malu, you right, know? Right. Right. So it's probably um what what God wants me to be. Amen. Yung album naman, sira mo sa akin during the break na ikaw na magsabi about people wasting time sa mga events, sa mga... Oh, when you're... You, <clears throat> when this... Our Filipino artists are being um, interviewed or uh, asked to perform to promote their talent and or and their voice, you know, but they usually sing cover songs, which is not bad. But, you know, when you sing cover songs, it's not very hard to sing it the way you want it. Mm, to okay. own it, you own it. But if you just copy the way the the original singer sang it, you're just promoting the original singer. Rock, okay. You know, but what? Why were you at the show to promote yourself, your talent? But it doesn't w- work like that. So that's what I'm trying to say right now for the young young generation. You know, starting to write songs and be unique and Keep on singing it because someday you'll never know. You know, someday you'll never know who's gonna pick it up. Galing. So, ikaw gawa ka lang, gawa ka lang talaga ng gawa. Gawa ako ng gawa. Nakakilan album ka na ba? Uh, nakadalawa na ako. Dalawa na. How many doing, songs each? Yung isa, walo. Wow. Yung isa, ano eh, um, after nung first album ko, it happened na, yung second, ano, single na lang kasi parang, wala nang bumibili ng album. album eh. Puro downloads Pero na. so, nagsa Spotify ka. Mga I'm, on, I'm there. I'm nice. like a virus. <laughs> I'm everywhere. <laughs> you cannot get rid of me. <laughs> wala pa yung malu vaccine. <laughs> Hindi mangyayari yun. <laughs> Which is okay. So, your songs are on Spotify. We'll put a link in the description, by the way, para at least may makapunta sila ron. Mm-hmm. So, ngayon, Pati ba mga songs, ikaw rin nagpaproduce ng sarili mo yes, mga songs? Yes. Ikaw rin nagsusulat? Yes. Ako rin naggagumagawa ng music. Lahat. Yeah. And then yung band, yung band mo, ang huli kong kita, lahat sila puti. Yeah. Yeah. Except my bass player. He's, he's a Filipino but he doesn't speak Tagalog. Sino bass player mo? Si Ed. Ed, uh, Ed Bon. Okay. And uh, he's been with me for nine years. Your drummer? My drummer, um, he, he used to be white, you know, but Right now, um, because of the pandemic, I replace it with another person who's, who can be available all the time. <laughs> or maybe you. <laughs> BC. Pacos, please. <laughs> Hindi, pag nag- gusto mo, pag nag-guess ka dito, papalo ako. Yeah. Sige. Para at least, ano, makapag-jam tayo. Yeah. Ngayon, itong mga taong to, ang tagal na nila sa'yo. Ibig sabihin, maalaga, maalaga ka talaga. I do. I do. I take care of them. I take care of them a lot. I pay for my studio. You know, we only play an hour or sometimes 30 minutes. I pay them well. But why, why do you think, no? Why do you think, in spite of what you do, in spite of ito mga taong to, feeling mo, naiingit sa'yo, how can we avoid friction sa community natin? Is it unavoidable? It's unavoidable. Oh, okay. You know, like, Come on, you know, every jungle, there's a snake, so... Oo nga, pero, pero isitin mo, eto, for argument's sake lang, mm-hmm. paano kung ang pagiging snake is nasa, sa, nasa perception mo lang? I don't think so, because this thing... Kasi kung snake siya, dapat hindi lang siya snake sa'yo, snake siya sa lahat. Ng... Yeah, it's okay. ha- it happened like that. Baga may, may reputation na Reputation na talaga. If I tell you these people, the one that I restrained, He has another court coming in. May another ganun person. Talaga, may ganun talaga. Yeah. There are people right now, they just change group. They have problems. And you can't, when you're nice, you know, okay, just join us, you know. Don't be alone. I'm like that. Don't be alone. Join us, you know. Maybe you'll meet your boyfriend, you know. 
So, inclusive ka naman pala talaga. Yeah, yeah. But I'm very welcoming. They, they come to my house. They eat in my house. And you have a problem with me. You can't talk to me. There's a problem with you. You know. Wow. I'm not the perfect person, you know. And if, if sometimes I'm performing, my focus is with my job and my band. I cannot be like too drunk. How can I lead my band? You know, and I'm also the host. I'm all, I'm I'm talking. Once I finish my show in House of Blues, I go around that foundation room and talk to all the people. I come back to my stage with 500 in my pocket. <laughs> Kasi pwede ng tip doon. <laughs> okay, malu pag-usapan natin yan. No? When we come back, pag-usapan naman natin how to build a show malu Toller style. After this word. And we're back with Miss Malu Toller. And before the break, that four second break, by the mm-hmm. way, ABBA eServices, thank you very much for the chairs. We really appreciate your support. Maraming salamat sa pag-donate ng uh, ating magagandang chairs. By the way, ang tawag namin sa chair na yan is the Hitmaker Chair. Really? Yeah. Is this is it electric? No, but <laughs> it's electrifying. Alam mo kung bakit? Alam mo kung bakit yan specific chair na yan, hit maker chair. Ang ang original na may-ari niyan is Vince Nantes. He's a songwriter. Mm. And he he's writ, written songs for um the Philippines, yung It's More Fun, siya mm-hmm. nagsulat noon. Yeah. Tapos naging co-writer siya ni Apple the App. Mhm. Tapos ang huli niyang project was BTS, yung K-pop na... Oh, sa K-pop? Siya yung nagsulat na yung... BTS is the biggest yeah, 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 band yeah, right now. Yeah. Isa sa mga hit songs nila, siya nagsulat. Oh. While sitting on that chair. That's cool. Pero, That's pero cool. hindi niya sinulat dito sa Pacos Prisa. <laughs> <laughs> yung chair na yan. Nasa bahay pa niya at nasa studio din yung time Tama. na yun. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Tapos biglang nung sabi niya, I'm letting go of the chair. Oh, maybe na, uh, I, I will write a better song. There you go. <laughs> Mali mo, it might rub in. <laughs> no pun intended. Anyway, shout out to you, Vince Nantes. Now, let's talk about building a show Malu Toller style. Because sa pinag-usapan natin, you're very disciplined. Tinanong kita kung plinano mo lahat and sinabi mo sa akin kanina was, hindi ba dapat? Which means, you know how to play chess. You're always yeah. a step or two steps ahead. Eh. Yeah. So how do you build a show And how is it successful? I'll tell you what, what I mean by that. Huh? People in the community, the Filipino-American community, think na pag hindi nila pinuntahan yung show na yan, hindi successful. I beg to disagree because that's not the definition that's of a not, successful yeah. show, right? I've known from people who've seen your show that they had fun and they liked your show and they vouch that your shows are successful. Okay? Yeah. How... Does Malu Toller build a show? You can't believe this. <laughs> When I create a show, I go to Vegas, I go to other places, I get ideas, you know? It's like... So, totoo nga yung sinasabi nilang nagtatapis ka lang. And, kasi yeah. Vegas style, so... No! <laughs> tapi- What's tapis? <laughs> yung nakaganon lang. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, really, I pick up from other bands I, I, and then... I will remember a, a, a set of songs will be good and I'll look at myself like I'm, I'll be the audience. Ah. Okay, I'll be the audience right now. What do I want in my show? You know? Ano magpapa-excite sa'yo? Diba? As the audience, yeah, yeah. the audience, yeah. So, I always want to have an opening act. Mm. You know, so let them settle down. Let them right. wait. And then at the same time, I'm, gi- I'm sharing this stage. So, ikaw rin ang director ng show? I do, yeah. I I I I set it up everything. Then I tell my husband, "Hey, during the break, can you play this song?" So So pati yung music during the break is part of the whole show. The whole show. Para yung experience nila diretso. Right. Pa it's the, it's even if Al Jazeera is with me the DJ, I said, "I'm ending up with this song. You start with this song." So the level of of the enjoyment is still the same you know it's still the same like if i if i ended strong you come in strong so and you know what? So there are some people who are offended by that i inisip nila na ba't mo dinidiktahan and all that stuff pero may point karon maganda yung sinasabi mo because 
you're all about the audience experience. Eh. Yeah. Diba? And then these people that I hired to work with me, like I'll just, we have the same ano, eh, vision for the Ayun. show, which is really important. Explain further for those who um, are trying to grasp you that. Got, you got to work with people who believes in you and who believes in the kind of music that you play and he trusts you and trusts you that you know what you are doing. You know, you don't hire someone that will tell you what to do. Ooh. And you're not going to be the one you that you want to be on stage. Malina, who's the boss? Yeah, that's why I don't want managers. I don't like them to change me, you know. Especially if they ask me to wear a dress. <laughs> I punch them. <laughs> <laughs> now, expenses, ikaw rin yan. Of course. Of course. But I get sponsors. Ikaw rin yun. Ako din yun. Paano ka manghihingi ng pera sa sponsors? Well, I, I connect with... Sisitsitan mo rin sila, mga tulad na pagsitsit mo sa akin, gano'n. <laughs> yeah. Psst. Yeah. Even the person who doesn't want to smile, I will make her smile. You know? But, the, you know, when you're, you're, you're preparing for the show, of course, you want it to be always successful. I don't, I don't sleep right away. I want to make sure that, hey, are we ready? You know, I call my band. My band, we rehearse every week before right. the pandemic. Whether we have a gig or not, we rehearse. Para tight lang, no? Yeah. Para yung banda yeah. ni Michael. Ganun din yung banda ni Michael Abad. Nagre-rehearse din sila. One, What's the band? Yung New Day in August. Once, oh. once a week, pero once a year lang din yun. <laughs> Ayan, New Day in August, ha? Kinocall out ko kayo, ha? <laughs> okay. So, with that, once a week is good because para tight talaga yung band. Yeah, diba? because mm-hmm. other bands are just like they perform, they're gonna perform. Like, you call these people like, hey, where, uh, can we rehearse? Why? Do we have a gig? Right. What? Walang commitment, no? I know. It's like... How important is commit? Okay. Question. So, your band is committed to you. Mm-hmm. But they're not on retainers, no? Some. <laughs> <laughs> um, Tinano ka ni JJ kung may questions na off no, the no, table. No. Sinahin mo, wala. I ha? cannot say no because <laughs> I'm helping out one of my brother in the band. Okay. So, you know, he didn't have a transportation. So, I, I have other car and I said, you could just continue this right. one. So, okay. So, may ganun tayo. And, it's safe to say na Hindi lahat naka-retainer, but everybody is committed to showing up every week. Yeah, they were. They were. And I, you know, every show, I don't know if you've seen my, you heard about me, I always have new songs every show. Every okay. show. I have to make sure. Or otherwise, I don't want to sing. Again, you're putting yourself in the audience place. Because, yeah, yeah. Bakit ko na naman papanoon itong babaeng to eh? The same songs. Same songs na naman yeah, nakakantayin yeah. ito. yeah. And I changed my lineup. I, I do that too. I'm the one uh, uh, preparing this. Are service. they allowed to suggest? Your yeah, bandmates? they can. They can. But it's so hard for them to understand because when you, you create a set list, it's like a roller, roller coaster ride. Yes. You know, like... You're telling a story. Yeah, yeah. There should be. But okay, I'm, I'm doing this rock and roll, everything, and go slow down, slow rock. And then you ask me to play Aki Breaky. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> you understand me, right? Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> so, uh, okay, question. Dun sa part 10 sa Aki Boy, uh, Aki Breaky because there might be a time you'll have to call an audible, di ba? We, call, we play it, we do. Kung baga, parang in the middle of the set, bigla may, bring, may oh, nakatuwaan. Is your band ready for, yes, for those kinds of things? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Because we play also with, um, like, um, in Josephine's, right? Yeah. We, people go there to dance. Yes. So I told them, you know, it's not bad and we have to show them that we can do whatever, anything. Right, right. And the way I tell them is, I'm not, I'm not really bossy when I'm on stage. I'm, I, I'm in the studio. I'm not. I just want them to listen to me. Hey, please listen to me. I have, uh, I'm the voice of the band. And if I lose this voice, there's not, no money for all of you. So they keep quiet. <laughs> Galing, no? Right? That's but you know what? It's nice that you're in control kasi. It's very nice. But it takes a person to be trusted by guys, yeah. you know? So before they join me, I, I, I ask them, do you, are you okay with a woman telling you to do something? Because if you're, you don't, 
then the door is open. Ikaw ba nagbubakas na pinto? Pa? No. <laughs> it's already open. <laughs> but really, I had band members who are like that. Now, of course, hindi pantay-pantay ang kita, di ba? The band gets a certain amount of money, you keep the rest. At the same time, pag lugi, the band still gets the same amount of money. Yes. You lose, I don't get you lose the rest. Tama yes, ba? yes. But <clears throat> my thing is that if I have a, the tips, hati-hati yon. I give it to them. Oh. Hati, I'm not sharing it anymore. Galego? I'm not sharing it anymore. I'm, I have other jobs. You know, I, I'm a realtor. Ang galig. So let's say kumita yung banda ng tips na $10,000, they get it all. They get it all. Galing. But listen, when I'm performing, Remember you I you said I said uh-huh. right I'm using the two to tell them that I'm a realtor I already have the microphone so why not Okay now it's now it's now it's making sense <laughs> It's making perfect sense <laughs> It's my okay. marketing tool Malu Toller yes you you are your own billboard <laughs> your audience is your okay your audience <laughs> is your clientele Yeah yeah and my my um, my uh, mortgage company, my escrow company, my title company, but I also created my own group of followers. The me- the, the, the media mogul businesswoman, <laughs> ibang klase ka talaga idol. Well, that's what I think. Why not tell them on stage? Hey, you know, if you have a question about the. Total rate. show mo naman It's to. my show. <clears throat> and, oh my God. And I put all my, my flyers on the table in my business cards. But I'm doing it. <laughs> I, I want to take advantage of that. Well, rightfully so. Right? I have oh. the right to do that. So this is your mortgage company? No. Um, you work for this mortgage company? Yeah. Yeah, and then I'm, I'm under Century 21. Um, uh, for realty, diamond. for oh yeah, for uh, as a realtor. And then I have a life insurance with. Um, I I do life insurance, but I don't. Do you you're not allowed to promote the life insurance company. You're not allowed to say that because there are people who who works for Primerica and WMD. I'm and gonna tell to. you, I don't do that. I have the license. Okay. But the reason why I took the license, so my clients when they ask me about it, I know how to answer it. Nice. Right? But I don't You're not market. selling it. You're not I'm marketing not, it. Okay. I don't like it. <laughs> I don't, okay. Escrow company. You, you work with an escrow company. Yeah. Also. I work with escrow companies. You know, I give them deals. You know, so of course, they help me out too. Now, Miss Malu, the realtor, when is it the best time to buy a house? Para sa ating mga... Ngayon, ngayon, ito na yung time na pwede ka na mag-promote din. Well, right now, it should be the best time. But hello, if you don't have a down payment and... um. But good the credit? Ra- the, yeah, you have a good credit. <clears throat> you know, 700, 680 and above, you can get a good rate. The rate is 2.7, Ang guys. Sarap naman. If you refinance, you can take out some money and you c- will pay the same amount that you're paying right now. Ang even at least, I think even lower. Lo- you can get, my friend took 100,000, you know, and, and then your mortgage is still, still the same his, amount his of money. His mortgage is only $100 more. But you have 100000 Why not? And then your 100000 eh, pwede mo invest, invest yun. Invest, oh. yeah. That's what I'm doing for them, you know. They're investing too. So, so uh, we'll, we'll, we'll put the Malu's number nga pala sa, sa description para kung meron kayong mga consultation questions, pwede nyo rin tanongin and si Malu. And if, if, you, if you get the client for me, I will... Make sure I take care of this Paco place. Oh, so yes, you know? yes, yes, yes. You yes. can count on me on that. I, uh, for all these people that's ruining me, have you heard <laughs> someone saying he, she didn't pay me? Exactly. Do I, I never cheated anyone. You asked me for 300, here's 500, get away. <laughs> we get away, pa. <laughs> <clears throat> right? You know, of all those people that's really. Uh, trashing me is they don't what what is it I don't get it right so you like you like you you like people I love people I love to make people happy that's my that that's the only thing I like to do 
you know? And syempre, itong mga taong ito na bumibili ng bahay sa'yo, happy sila and... And I'm not a, like a realtor, like, you know, like... Hindi ka pushy. I don't intimidate them. I'm still a rock star when I'm there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm, I make it like, I'm guiding them to learn how to buy a house because it's not easy to understand, especially the mortgage. Right. Mortgage is the most important thing in buying a house. If you don't understand, that's also your investment. That's where you you put your money, your mm-hmm. savings. Yep. So you have to understand the interest rates, you know? Some people, they don't. Can you explain it to them? I do, I do. And actually today, I said, I, I had yes. lunch at four. Oh my God, I had this clients who's been wanting this house and I was only the loan officer you know and someone oh so me realtor ito you're, you're wearing your mortgage hat dito yeah, sa yeah 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 but <clears throat> people make mistakes you don't focus on the mistake you look for the solution and I got it I got it he, he's signing loan docs right now I I'm so proud of it that's why I said let's rock and roll honey let's go out <laughs> me should accomplish for yeah. me nasa bahay ka lang dito yeah okay, I wake up at 6.30 and then uh, I do my papers and everything and then go for a walk for two miles and then I come back you know and then uh, I continue my walk galing no yeah. can you say can you can you say Malu that um, looking back at your life you've accomplished a lot would you change anything ba wala no I'm meant to be here, I'm meant to be where I am, and I'm meant to be who I am with right now. And I am so lucky to be married to my ex-boyfriend. Yummy! 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 Totoo naman eh. 22 years, come on. 22 years, marries. It's it's an accomplishment. Yeah. It's, you know, being married is not easy, you know. You have to speak English. <laughs> oh nga ba? Ano? Ikaw lang ba nagtatagalog sa bahay nyo? Mm-hmm. Oh my God. Yeah, so, you know, most of our doors are broken. <laughs> Ayaw mo na magmura eh. <laughs> Ang hirap mag-English. Binabalibag mo na mo siya. <laughs> ah, shit. <laughs> Di ba ganun sa Pilipinas? <laughs> Tumigil siya. Ah, shit. <laughs> now, what will you tell the 16-year-old or the 14-year-old starting their path mm-hmm. into adulthood who are going to make mistakes? Can you please pretend that they are your sons, they are your daughters, mm-hmm. and please give them the advice that Malu Toller will give? Well, I don't, you know, I don't say that I didn't make mistakes when I was, you know, starting, starting. I chose some songs that are not good for me, but... Life alone, hindi lang songs, ha? Gusto ko pati yung, yung mag, mag, mag-decide itong mga taong nakikinig, eh. Nakikinig sa'yo. Uh, yeah, man. what I mean is like everything you, you if you make a mistake, Consider it as a learning process, you know. You you learn from your mistakes and then the next time, don't quit. You just keep on doing it and make it better. But the only thing I can tell them is that if you really want to go somewhere, find out where you want to go so we will tell you what direction to take. Galing. You know, are you going to take the freeway or just the side, side street, right? So... I really, you know, I'm teaching uh, guitars to the kids every summertime, you know. I start teaching the nine, nine years old. And then most of them, I don't charge. And then, and then I promise them, hey, if you can play this, the next one, I'll give you a free tuner. Oh. So they're motivated. I'll give yeah, you yeah, yeah. And then don't buy guitar first. I tell the parents, don't buy the, your guitar first. Let me see if he's really interested. So... I tell him, if you can play this, I'll buy you a guitar. Because every time you buy in Guitar Center, you know, yeah, yeah, yeah. you get a free guitar, I give it to them. Uh, All right? It's just a beginner's guitar. So I, I motivate and Some of them are so good now. But you have to know what you're, where, what, you're going. where you're going. Destination yeah. is important. If yes. 
Para ka lang ano, paikot-ikot na hindi mo alam. And you just follow whoever and th- that person you're following doesn't even know where they're going to. You know? And you have to know what is your genre. So a lot of Filipinos, when you say genre, they don't get it. I don't know why. And, and uh, when you go to Hollywood or you go to, you know, here, the first thing they ask you, what's your, what's your genre? You know, ballroom? Rock, classic rock. You, so if you're going to work for a producer, make sure that that producer, like for example, I'm a rock band. And I went to this producer who only produced R&B music. Mm. It's not going to happen. Indie much. Yeah. Indie much. So I only use one producer for my songs because I want my voice to be always the same. Right. If I change another a producer... It's like Lady Gaga. Now her, her voice is Correct. different, right? Mm-hmm. Because she changed the producer. Now, sa mga tao naman na nakakatikim ng batiko sa ibang tao, anong advice mo naman sa kanila? Ignore, ignore, ignore. Nakaka, nakakapangit yun. Tsaka, you know, I've learned from my experience, the more you pay attention to them, the more they want it. You ah. know, but be happy and they're angry. So I'm happy. Sorry. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Malu Toller. I love it. Yes, thank, thank you, thank for you so me. much. Don't forget to subscribe, guys. Huh? Immigration purpose.